My name is Jeff Tuff. I am the hydrogen lead for Deloitte here in the US. The panel was on um, the future for clean hydrogen. I'm probably going to get the panel name exactly wrong, but um, what we were talking about primarily was how we think about scaling clean hydrogen in the short to medium term. I, I was expecting actually to hear from some of our panelists when I asked the question about what time frames were relevant, that we're looking at the 5, 10, 15 year time frame, but every single one said we got to get going tomorrow. And so a lot of the panel was discussing how we get going as quickly as possible and actually start to drive some of that scale. The hydrogen conferences that have, are being run, whether it's Hydrogen Americas or World Hydrogen, are absolutely critical for bringing different types of players together into one place to have discussions, not just you know, formal discussions up on stage, but all the people that you meet literally walking down the hallway are the people you end up doing business with. It's true for Deloitte, it's true for anyone that works in anywhere in hydrogen. This is where you come to meet the players that actually matter. So a big part of the discussion we had on the panel was really about the difference between being a first mover in hydrogen, no matter where you work in the value chain, um, or being a fast follower. And I left really energized from the panel, having heard from every single one of them that they believe that there is real risk in not being a first mover. And that gives me great hope that, you know, with a bit of policy clarification and a little bit more on the IRA, we are really gonna see the clean hydrogen economy take off here in the US and in the Americas more broadly. We're um, super excited about the prospect of clean hydrogen. We at Deloitte have uh, put a lot of our attention globally into it. As you may have heard, others have heard, we've committed a billion dollars to climate and sustainability around the world. And a good portion of that is going to making low carbon intensity hydrogen a reality for everyone. So we're excited about it.